Hello viewers, it's Sriram here from Sri Learning. We are smiling, laughing loud here because some technical glitch happened. Now we're able to do the recording. So now, uh, Olustin is with us. He cleared PMP recently. It's a beautiful success story because he has a lot of hurdles around the way around him, but he's able to clear the certificate. Getting certificate is only a part of your journey because you have a big goal in your life. You want to become a leader. You want to become a person who can drive things around you. And you found that there is something skill with you which you can show to the world. That's a starting point is this certificate. So let's first congratulate uh, Listin for getting this. I'm going to clap hands for him telling, hey man, you did it. <laughs> he did it, good. So uh, before we jump into, I'm going to show his certificate. Before that, uh, let's first listen from Listin. Congratulations Listin from Sri Learning. Let's hear your words. Thank, thank you very much. Um, it has been a very long uh, journey and a lot of hookups because I was supposed to have done this like a year ago, but um, a lot of things came up. I had my training. I actually had my training. I finished my training a year ago, more than a year ago. And the target was to do the exam immediately. But along the way, there was um, COVID-19 lockdown. And my most of my colleagues, they are um, on vacation there. And they could not come back. So the whole job pressure was on me. <laughs> I'm holding like this. <laughs> <laughs> well, at the end of the day, uh, thanks to God, I could be able to at least close it, tick it. <laughs> All right, great. So listen, uh, before we further move more, uh, which country you are from? And what is your domain? I'm from, yeah, I'm originally from Nigeria. Mm -hmm. uh, but I'm working here in Saudi Arabia. Ah, okay. That's an oil-rich place. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. A little bit gold, huh? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oil is everywhere, even on the streets. <laughs> uh, yeah. So what is your domain? What is the nature of job? Um, I'm in maritime industry. Mm -hmm. We are actually um, a major contractor. I'm working with a company that is a um, major contractor to Aramco in terms of their logistics uh -huh. and their production. Uh -huh. we, we have um, a fleet of vessels, different kind of vessels, like uh -huh. um, Jacob Badge like okay. utility vessels, like accommodation badge for Aramco staff and for their projects. So it's a long term project. Right, right, lengthy project. Now tell me, how come this PMP thought came to you? Why, why do you thought of PMP? Is there any push from your organization? Hey, you want to do PMP? Uh, well, to be, to be honest, uh, my kind of job is a job that you don't even need all this, they believe in um, experience. How long, how long have you been doing this? What right. project have you done? But I just want to think out of the box and move out of that chain that, okay, apart from the experience which I got, I needed something officially to back it up, that wow. I can manage a project, I can right. initiate it and I can close it at the same time. Great. That's really positive note. With this note, you'll see that beautiful orange certificate. Here it goes. A oh, beautiful one, beautiful one. On April 10th, this wonderful thing happened. Fantastic. So the moment you saw this orange certificate, I'm sure you would have felt excited. Wow, I've done some good job. Okay. So now, uh, quickly you'll understand. You went for this exam as an online exam or you went to the center? Um, I did it online on this particular seat. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's interesting. So uh, let's listen to your experience. So how was the exam in the sense of uh, the, the, the information on the sense of question toughness? How do you find it? Well, um, thanks to you first. Let me start by that. And um, during the lockdown that I could not do the exam, that I was busy. When I, start, when I decided to go for the exam, what I just did is I just went through all the training you gave us, the recorded word, 
I just went through it from end, from the beginning to the end. Then I, go, I went through my jotter. So it was, while I was even reading, it was little that I was just jotting down. Then immediately I click on uh, apply for the exam and I paid for it. Wow, mm, good, good. Yeah, and nice. it was not bad. Yeah, that's nice, that's nice. I, I like the way you did, you listen to the recording because sometimes in the class, you would have got some information. When you re-listen it, certain new topics can come up. That's quite interesting. Yes, please go yeah. ahead. Yeah. Um, the recording did um, amazing. It did most of the job, to be honest with you, because it was just like I'm um, in the fresh class again, a new class again. So I just uh, dedicate myself for the four hours. I will, I'm going through and jotting. Then after after that, after I did it every weekend, which is four Saturdays. Then after that, I just for two weeks, I just read. Uh -huh. all the material that um, you shared with us. I read it, then I check online for some questions mm -hmm. and some ideas. And after that, I just paid. And the question came, when do you want to write the exam? OK, I just did the next day. I paid on Friday. I did the exam on Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That's it, huh? <laughs> I did the exam on Saturday. I was initially on Saturday, I was so panicked because I woke up early. I took a lot of coffee because I know I'm going to sit down for four hours. And uh, I was like, okay, what is going to happen today? Okay, let's see. Then uh, when the time comes, someone uh, from the from online chat with me, okay, let me turn your camera, let me see your table. Oh, he said, move all the paper on your table, your printer, move it back, your uh, other laptop, move it down, your, take your um, passport, photo, stuff like that. Then push your uh, phone very far away from you. So I started, the guy said, do I have any other questions? I said, no. Okay, he said, okay, we can start now. So when I started and the AC was on, so I was, very cute, and uh, I started having running notes along the way because I did not even go for any break. They asked me for, do I need them? I said, no, I just want to finish and... Oh, <laughs> man. You should have taken a break. I should have taken a break. So I started having um, running notes because of the AC. So I, I come back to off the AC. Immediately, there's another lady that just... Uh, uh, we saw you looking back. What do you want? Do you want anything? I said, no, I'm having um, flu. I need to off the AC. He said, if you do that again, uh, you'll be disqualified. Oh, I said, okay, sorry. I'm not going to do that again. <laughs> <laughs> so I just tried to round up and um, finish the exam. I think I see I had uh, like um, 45 minutes left. So I used that to review what I've done. Big time. 45 minutes remaining is a big time. Yes, yes. It was amazing. Yes. So you went at a good speed that I can sense it. Yes. Um, but the ones I'm not sure of, I'm I'm leaving there just to run off of what I'm 100 percent sure of. Uh -huh. So immediately I finished the whole thing. I went back to check on the one I'm not sure of. That was the one I was um having my time, leaving, giving time to think right. and to. But the right. result was amazing because the old in the old section I was above average, which is amazing stuff. <laughs> right. oh, okay, that's fantastic. That's fantastic. Great, uh, Austin. In fact, I'm so surprised the way without break you keep in going next, 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 next. I think I appreciate your energy level. <laughs> yeah, thank you so much. That's thank great. you. That's good. When you read the question, <clears throat> did you felt? These are the questions which you already worked in your real life. Did you feel some connectivity? Um, okay, what actually happened was this. Immediately after my training with you, my the way I walk changed. Ah, okay. Immediately after the training, the way I manage project change, mm -hmm. I started um, using your training 
I oh. started using it in my personal life, in, wow. my, in my job. So I think the whole waiting period was just a practical training for me. So the way I communicate, even with, my, with the stakeholder in the office change, the way I communicate with uh, the top management, with, the, with our major client, which is Aramco, changes. Uh -huh. So after that, even my um, boss, my manager that I'm reporting to, he right. noticed that something changes. Is there anything? I said, maybe it was because of the lockdown. <laughs> like something changes in you. So my, 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 the way I work changed immediately after the training. So during the lockdown, so whatever I come across, oh, I was okay, okay, let me use this wow. to solve this kind of particular issue. So while I was listening to the um, audio recording again and doing the reading, it's brighter for me, it's clearer for me that, okay, so it's make it easy for me. So I was just focusing on the, on the question, okay, this is the this is what they want. Okay, now I'm a project manager. Yeah. This is what how am I going to solve this kind of scenario if I find myself in this kind of scenario? So I was just thinking out right. outside the box of my domain. Amazing. I'm so impressed. Yeah. The way you started applying it. Uh, this is this is the one thing which I try to tell many people. Please apply what you learn. That's the best way of holding that information with us. Fantastic, great, great, good job, good job from you. So your, your senior manager would have observed what happened to this guy? He's slightly different. Huh? <laughs> okay. <laughs> like some, something changed, something changed in you. What is going on? <laughs> so so did, you, did you show the certificate in your office? Hey, I cleared it. No, no. Because, uh, Okay, there was a time I had a meeting with um, our company, the vice president. Our, our company is a very big company, well-known in Saudi, one of the top leading companies in Saudi. So I had a meeting with the guy, um, he's a Saudi. So the guy, I, I noticed the guy is very sound, very intelligent. So I was like, um, boss, uh, did you have any certification? He said, no, I only had my first degree in Florida and uh, the normal training. I said, have you heard of something uh, called PMP? He said, yeah, I heard about it, but I, I don't even have time to do it. I really want to have that certificate. Okay, I kept quiet. So there was a day I was talking to our, um, con I was having a meeting with our contract department, the, the head of the unit. Uh, so he now saw me reading my jota. He said, what are you reading? I said, I'm supposed to write an exam, but because of lockdown, I could not do it, PMP exam. He said, ah, I did the training, but man, I could not even write the exam. I wish I wrote it immediately after the training. I was like, okay. So <laughs> then I decided that even if I make this, I'm not going to share this with these guys. <laughs> okay. okay, I understand you do good stakeholder management there. <laughs> <laughs> So I need to manage my stakes so that very well. Oh, now you are above us, right? Uh -huh. so I just kept quiet. So I'm keeping it for um, next opportunity, right. which I'm hoping is going to come and it's going to be very huge. Yeah. I know this uh, PMP is a highly valued in Arab, Arab, US, Canada, Australia. So these are the places, uh, the PMP is in a highly in demand, specifically in Arab. They consider uh, the PMP as a golden certificate. If somebody has that and the way they implement it, they get amazing job opportunities. I'm so happy that and congratulations for your job going forward. Thank, thank you so much. Thank you so much. So what is this football? Something in your shirt. You are a football club guy? Yeah, this is actually Nigerian uh, football jersey. Wow. And you, you, I, the, you play? You play? I, I I used to be a goalkeeper, but I'm a fan uh -huh. of Manchester United, big fan of Manchester United, and big fan of my national team, Super Eagle, That's Nigerian great. football team. <laughs> That's great. I do follow some of it, but not all. But uh, yeah, good to see somebody playing football. Football makes you fit body and mind. 
right? This True. A very strategic game. Amazing. Yeah. Fantastic. Great. Good knowledge. Team. So listen now. Now, if you want to give some tips to people, hey guys, do this for your preparation. What will be your tips? Ah, uh, to be honest, if um you are in kind of my situation, like busy, busy job, busy occupied time, I will recommend you to try to be for the for the part for the study period, sleep early, wake up very early when your brain is still very fresh, maybe around four o'clock, read for one hour. Don't take it too much. For one hour, four to five. Before doing any other thing, before you occupy your brain, I think that stick to your brain. And um, before you even go to the exam, try to apply what you have learned into your daily routine. That will make it, no matter how they twist the question, no matter how they bring up the question, you say, okay, I'm a project manager. If I find myself in this kind of situation, what is the right thing for me to do? What is the major thing for me to do. And um, I'm lucky, I'm working with um, my major client, which is Aramco. They don't joke with projects. They are dealing, they are, their project is always project management. Even all their top management, they have project um, PMP certified. So it is easy, whenever they are pushing something, you know, okay, this is what these guys are doing. This is what I've learned. So I applied it to my daily routine, my daily job, my activity. So it makes it very easy for me. Wow. And, with, and with your training, it's like a piece of cake, to be honest with you. It's wow. not a, yeah, with your training, because I cannot imagine not being trained by you and think I can pass the exam, no way. <laughs> you analyze it, you make us to, you, you did something for me. You made, you made me to know how those guys are even thinking. The guys that we set a exam, how they are thinking, what they expect from you. So I'm just using all those kind of um, knowledge you have put in me to answer, to tackle the questions. Amazing. And it was amazing. amazing. That's a great, wonderful tips I have ever, ever heard. Two things is <laughs> wake up in the morning, first thing, open the book and read. Okay. I like that. I kind of highly recommend it. Second one, apply what you've done, right? That's exactly, exactly, exactly. No matter how little, no matter how, even if you are working with a small company, yeah. take them to the next level right. as they move them forward. This is how things should be done. This is how we should control our communication. This is right. how we should deal with our stakeholder. You know, this is how we should minimize our risk. You know, <laughs> all right. All right. I, I can, I'm seeing a CEO in front of me. Amazing. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Inshallah. <laughs> yes, yes. Uh, see, the being top two person is not about only the marks and scores. It's about the mindset. Um, how do you how do you think of yourself? How do you apply it? That makes you top two person. So I wish all the best for you being a top CEO. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> One more question. One more question. We have something called Agile, which is a little yep. new market now. How do you manage it? I believe you may not highly utilize Agile in your industry, but were you able to catch it up? Um, well, we are not using Agile in my kind of industry, but um, during my preparation, I try to do some um, findings online oh, and I did some reading. Okay, right. now it's not my, uh, is, we are not using it, but I need to, if I find it along the way, I need to pass it. While we are in school, there's a lot of things we are not needed, you know, and, they, and we just have to learn it. You know, there are some things you just need to learn to pass the exam, to go through, to have idea. So I did some, um, um, find these online, check, 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 check. Then I could able to jot things out just to close this exam. But while even reading, I now realize I don't even mind to train to know more about this. Yeah, wow. you know. 
that same policy, that same policy. I, I like the way you uh, do yourself. So how do you manage it? You wake up every day early morning and uh, you have to complete all your studies, then go for office, come back. How was that? Yeah, um, this is how I manage it. My family are here. I have my kids here with my wife. So what I do is I, will, I wake up early. I will do my reading. Then I make sure my own show, like my own part of the job in the house is to clean the house, the sitting room. Mm -hmm. So I, I usually do it late at night before sleeping. So I don't have to do that in the morning. Uh -huh. <laughs> so my early hour time, I will just wake up, uh, do some little exercise, pray. Then I will read sometimes one hour, sometimes one hour, 30 minutes, sometimes two hours. Mm -hmm. Then I will just immediately after reading, I will try to do some little job from home so that guys will know, okay, I'm active. So even if I come to office late, they will know, okay, he has been working from home. It's okay. <laughs> so I try to manage that. So I now even realize even um, my top managers, they don't even mind me to be working that way. Okay, so far you are available. So I just use the time to focus on my um, PMP training and to close it. And they will see that I've changed now. I'll be coming to office early now. <laughs> yeah. So I think you ought to give credit to your family and your kid uh, in the sense of- Yeah, the yeah. Supported you, right? Yeah, yeah, especially my wife, yeah. Uh, she, she really wanted me to have it. She really wanted me to have it. Yeah. The family support is very important. They are the backbone of our whole system. Fantastic. Great. Super yeah. well, So much pleased for um, you coming up here and giving this wonderful interview. And uh, I can see the energy, Thank you so much. Uh, the energy with you. And I like the tips of what you gave. I feel it's going to help anybody across any domain, any age, any country. Yeah. 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 Great. Yeah. So one more time, congratulations for the upcoming CEO. And uh, thank you. <laughs> I can't wait. <laughs> so, so keep rocking, keep rocking, doing more. And uh, as I always say, that learning is one part, and implement it, and materialize it. Let the yeah. world ask, "Are you PMP certified?" By the yes. way. <laughs> yes, exactly. You should not show the certificate. Your work yeah. so that this guy should be certified. Yeah. <laughs> Let's yeah. To the world. Let's give a very honest and disciplined leadership that changes the system as a very positive way. Right? Good. Yes. Super. Any more points from you? Uh, nothing. Nothing. Okay. Nothing. <laughs> okay. Good. Uh, by the way, all the viewers, thanks for watching this uh, success story. I'm sure you got inspired. Leave your comments, leave your wishes to Olestin for his success. And you can also write your comments. What do you like in this interview? What inspired And we'll catch up in another interesting success story. We can inspire you to make yourself certified and also shine your job. That's very important, right? That's good. Okay, yeah. thanks for understanding for being here and thanks all the viewers for watching this program. Good luck. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Yeah.